This is a patient's 3D printed aorta. In this lab, engineers are able to simulate exactly what happens in a specific patient's heart. So what the simulator is currently doing right now is imposing physiological flow and pressure through the patient's aortic valve. It's a state-of-the-art model that allows experts to predict common complications in aortic valve surgeries, such as leaks, coronary blockages, and blood clots, giving patients like Bernice Belcher a greater chance for a full recovery. I trusted my physician, and I felt that they knew where they were doing. Bernice is thriving after her heart procedure thanks to a unique collaboration between doctors and engineers prior to surgery. Experts at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center use CT scans to create a 3D printed model, an exact replica of Bernice's aorta. They connected it to a heart simulator and reproduced the conditions of her heart and blood flow. The ability to try and predict which valve will rest in there the most effectively and have the least amount of leak and not impinge upon adjacent structures is critical. Doctors and engineers then discuss the results to confidently choose the best approach, valve, and placement for the patient, avoiding complications that sometimes arise after the valve is implanted. This 3D reconstruction and modeling has directly informed uh, the way we attack some procedures. By doing these experiments, we are able to come up with the best possible scenario for that patient. It's working for Bernice, who says she hasn't felt this good in years and is taking control of her heart health to keep it that way. At Ohio State Wexner Medical Center, this is Barb Consiglio reporting.